of the evening. We've already won map down. Bully your mom versus construction ahead. We've a advantage here. One map won by construction ahead. As we are about to delve into the next one, which is going to be Asin. And basically, we're going to see how it's going to go. What do you think, Kenu? Um, with the uh, introduction of, I think there's there's a there's a new the sub for Bully or Mom is, is has been replaced, but I don't think I still think it's the same person. Honestly, chicken butt. I mean, chicken nugget, chicken butt. They're all made from the same chicken. I think. Um, I think. I mean, never mind. I guess we might see a different play here. I'm I'm not still I'm still not sure just not, not from the based from the composition that they had before I'm not sure but maybe now oh. it may be different. We yeah. are going into agent select here as um we have already three agents picked by Bullion Mob Chicken Bud the new addition replacement as you said to Chicken Nuggets not going for the Jellies here actually going Ooh. for the Killjoy which I had predicted and they are going to be apparently on the two duelist fight with. 6-9 back on the Reyna, and Dark Ace leaving the Sage to take a Neon. A, a good chamber here for Corona, no initiator for that team. And we are going to see an Astra, which is a big surprise, actually. Ooh, okay, both, okay, optimized teams on both sides, no three of anything. Looks like they're gonna have an, a Smoker, two Duelists, and two Sentinels. No initiators, though, on defense side, which is interesting. But on attacking side, looks like we have a Sova, two duelists, and Chamber and Drago. And yeah, as you mentioned, Astra, interesting, interesting pick since you know the nerf made them sort of uh I guess a little underpowered now. Well, it's still usable, but a little bit more underpowered. Yeah. Yeah, but the, the thing with Astra with the nerf is not that she is unplayable, like she's yeah. still very useful. The thing is, especially when you go into low elo. It's really hard because you have really have to uh, uh, play with the team, you know, play with the communication, which is going to be interesting here. We're going to see if this Astra is indeed really keen on the communication, if uh, they are able to, you know, uh, get some maybe good suction when the teammates ask or things like that. So we're going to see. And I want to note here, the because we haven't talked about the, the team composition for construction ahead, we are seeing a Omen, we are seeing a Jet, a Chamber, a Sova. They are actually the aggressive team this time, and Bully or Mom is the very defensive team. It, it looks like they are basically betting on the first side that's be, that they are going to pay to play or they are going team. when they go in defense a defense is first a defensive team when they go on attack first an aggro team they're really betting on taking the most point on the first half of the round and we're already starting oh and fourth dude bully your mom had such a defensive setup on b it would have been hell if they didn't get the kill on that chamber especially with everything going on looks like they're just gonna go into b Spike no care in the world but Gets it going, Vendor tries to get that uh, gun, but doesn't get it. Tries to sneak onto lane, doesn't get the kill here, but maybe another repeat. No, that they don't get the kill at all. Super actually gets a kill on Chicken, but it's Acer with a 4k with Ghost onto Galaxy as a final. 0-1. I did not expect that, because honestly, they had three people, and there's two of their duelists on A. Three people B, and both, both Sentinels too. I was like, okay, this is going to be absolute hell. For construction ad. I I I was just I was there was just no nothing there. But it looks like well, Acer just took it back. That's basically how it is, but the thing is, you know, it's, they have such an aggressive comp, you know, Chamber, very aggressive sentinel, um Omen, very aggressive controller. So basically every one of them has the potential to be dualist carry even if they're not dualist. Yeah, it looks like wow. Here. Oh, oh. Okay, well, right now, nothing's like happening much. Looks like we are vendors here with, uh, yeah. trying to gather the information, and they are going to uh, try and get on the side, taking advantage here of Darkest uh, Neon Wall. But then, oh, Galaxy Sun unfortunately sucking them a lot. But then, that's an advantage because they are not really seen by the enemy. We are seeing here Chicken Butt, will they be able Oh, to defend, unfortunately, no. What is happening? Acer processor speed just got amped up in this, in this round. What is going on? 
Okay, it looks like they're just gonna move on with that 4k once more and they and they didn't even buy that round They were on, they were on bonus the whole time Absolutely, they've been on bonus the whole time, but the thing is with that bonus, bonus We are seeing a weird currency as they are playing a bonus run after a bonus run look at that what they have happening? they have money they have money but they are He's not using it i'm out of here Wait, what? He's, he has 6k right now and they're just like oh i don't care i'm gonna ghost I, i'm feeling I'm hot in the ghost but flashes out just only has light shields despite the 6k and they're just immediately gonna get those two picks what is Thunder oh, here with a suction? Unfortunately, okay, no Johnson. one comes to shoot at them. What is oh, okay? Okay, well, it looks like they just have 5v2 and they successfully have just infiltrated A with no chance. Well, and oh, it looks like they were trying to go for a cheeky knife play there. And look, <laughs> Chicken Butt's just gonna try and BM with a stinger and are just gonna run it down, but it looks like they're not gonna get that kill. However, they did. Managed to remove two people despite that, what whatever that was without their buy. I oh. got 22 HP, but Acer gets the kill, and that's what nine kills on Acer. What is going on? The Acer just had a ghost the whole time. Now they're on 9k round three. Absolutely, and this as you see, they are. And they have so much money on round three because they have been very likely buying going bonus run after bonus run and the thing is that's also a disadvantage here for bully your mom as well you know they are trying to go into economy rounds and low buy they are trying to make weapon fall but the thing is there is no weapon to fall drago is playing omen kami i think and then they're just gonna run it down b but they have a lot of people down b they won't be able to get that kill and they're just gonna run it down this Person's gonna take so much damage, but are they gonna get the kill? Yes, Chicken Butt gets the kill onto under the bed. I, I, I was wrong. This isn't the same person as Chicken Nugget. It, it clearly is, in fact, a different person that they're playing a Sentinel role. And looks like they're just gonna try and whittle down the numbers here. And CC9 gets another trade. 2v2 evening it out. Do they know that someone's on stairs? No. Nope. Acer gets another kill, but no. Funny number gets a kill on this Acer. Okay. Six and no. I here having absolutely no information as to where Drago is and Drago taking advantage of that making sure that they are sneaking what is happening right now 12-1 on Acer this feels like a smurf round what what is going on oh. well you know we, we've seen Acer previously on Chamber and I I think maybe, maybe Acer's uh, role usually is the Julius, maybe Reyna is the main and, you know, Chamber was just trying to fill in with a composition because he feels just so comfortable on the peak. It's just, it's just like, well, okay, whatever. Oh, looks like Corona's gonna get that first kill onto under the bed, unfortunately, but Acer that off angle on the top, gets a kill onto funny number, unfortunately, will they be able to get another one? No, Dark Ace gets a blind kill under that smoke, is it actually a blind kill if they, I'm not really sure if they saw them beforehand, but I'm just gonna assume that it was a blind kill, now they're just gonna converge towards mid, trying to get that play, and waiting for them, but, but now just... Oh, only has an, a marshal. Gets picked out by vendor. Tries to look out into a main to see if someone's uh, being a little cheeky, trying to peek out. Looks like vendor is gonna get, a, get another kill onto Perona, peeking out from mid. This guy is a menace in lurking, and now they're just gonna get B site for free because both of them are still stuck A, and they're just gonna run it down. Kimber, are they gonna get the plant down before they take any casualty, or are they just going to? Okay, I think they're just gonna get the plan down. They, they check that side, nothing there. They're just gonna uh, roll. Okay, oh, Fender again with another kill. This guy. This guy. Fender with another kill. And Fender being basically behind the kills, you know, being at an off angle compared to their teammates. So maybe setting up. Oh, maybe setting up a, an actual crossfire, but they don't. They actually try to aggro on the killjoy, making them low, but not enough so that they kill them, actually dying. But then we still have Drago and Kimber. Drago and Kimber always the last two standing, honestly. The, uh, wow. and, 
and okay. chicken but hey you know chicken yeah. but know that their economy is really bad so actually preferring to save that juicy juicy weapon that they so desperately need because their economy is really really low i'm so confused at what's happening they're just they're just pushing on the side but and then they rotate it and then vendor gets those lurk kills what what well, the thing is, like, the attack is really playing with the mind, rotating, fake rotating. We are seeing here, you know, that um, yeah. they, they even took an off angle. And sure, Dark Ace managed to get the kill on the one under the bed that was on the eye ground, but then, you know, the one under the bed just killed someone from the eye ground, so that was to be expected. And that's basically the only thing that happened. And chicken, but hey, with a kill toy OP, okay, that's original. And Dark is here trying to get big. And uh, again. Make, yeah, playing with the, actually the enemy omens, uh smoke, trying to get big. Six next thing, like taking the kill here on the fellow Reyna. They are not really able to do much. So look at that. Look at Ender. Kimber and the one in the bed uh, instead trying to rotate, but Vendor. This time being expecting on the flank, Drago the same. And honestly, Kimber and the one on the bed don't seem to know very well what to do, but actually the one on the bed knows what to do and it's to kill to kill 6 9 and make sure that uh, Kimber is able to rotate basically safely, trying to get picks, trying to set them back, slow them in the progression. But Verona here, Verona experience. Expecting Kimber on the B main and taking the kill as uh, the one under the bed dies. I mean, it has the first round for Bully Your Mom. First round for Bully Your Mom, yeah. That was a simultaneous kill, too. Like, they were trying, the, their, their, their jet was trying to push mid. They were like, okay, well, I'm gonna try to. Uh, we're, there's only two of us. We had to get the numbers down maybe a little so we can even this out and smoothen out the process. But unfortunately, uh, for, they get they get the timing correctly. They get we the kill, play, let's and they play. didn't win the round. They're, they're fine, unfortunately. Corona tries to get another kick there, but doesn't. He teleports out, and oh, the one under the bed fling very aggro here. Do they get the kill onto Neo? No, they don't. Dark Ace getting a kill onto under the bed. However, Acer gets a trade onto Dark Ace, smokes that out. There's mid guys just watching, and then okay. Very interesting what's happening here. Yes, Acer here with a very good Reyna ultimate, making sure that the shorty doesn't kill them and just defending themselves, sustaining with one his ulti. But oh, Kimber! Kimber on the ult! Kimber making sure that even though they planted, they are not about to win that run, making it a stick swan in favor of construction ahead. I was saying that they were betting on the defense with the defense, uh, oh, sorry, on the attack with a very ugly team. And honestly, that seems to be the good bet. They are making so many good points here on the first uh, half of the match that honestly, if they take a good enough advantage, winning the, ma the map is going to, you know, be basically easy. Even if they take a lot of rounds, you know, on the defense, they have a lot of rounds to, to lose. There are a lot of rounds to spare. Yeah, unfortunately, they didn't have that mid coverage for Kimber, so they just had a free, just a free aggro press on the tree, and then they get two picks, and that's another one for Acer, 3k. So they're just gonna go 16 3 on this round. Like, the numbers are just insane. This AC, this guy's ACS must be insane. They're, they're gonna have three people immediately into A main with funny numbers trying to push on, but. Oh, gets the kill under the bed. Are they just going to dismiss out? Yes, they do. And that's one person off of their list now it's just a mid split into a they're going to try and push they need to even know what corona is does gets two kills from that spot they even have a teleport out the vendor tries to get another one of these one enemy remains oh that's the knife what? corona you did not have to do it dirty like that and kimber unfortunately your time for tree pressing is not now corona gets a 4k Onto the both of them. That was insane. An off angle and a knife kill to boot. Wow. That's a knife kill. Verona is back in shape. Verona is back the way we know him. What the lurky happening? one that surprised them. Verona is just doesn't. I like. 
If this guy is named after no, the One Piece point. character Perona, I wouldn't be surprised. Well, I, I not do not know that character. But <laughs> honestly, I'm I'm falling I'm falling in love with him. Honestly. Oh, yeah, I could I could see I could see myself honestly like oh, this, this he's uh, their plays are just <laughs> so alert, it's so like surprising. It just it doesn't matter. I'm just going to push. I don't care. I'm going to be sneaky. I'm going to get you. Oh, under the bed gets a kill on the Killjoy backside. I, I mean, they've been playing that spot for so much for so long. It just doesn't matter. Dark Case getting a kill onto their vendor lurker, but they have B side for free, and now it's just going to be a retake for them. Exactly, a retake is going to happen on a three v four. It's advantage here, not that much, but still present. As the all attacking team is defending from the spawn, Acer here, Acer making one hell of a job. Getting edge shots after edge shots and sustaining every time. Now Dark Ace here trying to follow the trade to get the shot on Acer, unfortunately, to no avail. But then wow. Acer trying to go in, dying, but under the, uh, the one under the bed is actually here, actually going with Arena, taking the revenge, taking the round. It's a 2 7, and we're really. Uh, that's. That's. But they're getting rolled over, but you know, it's, they're still up. Very still. themselves right now. What? The heck? Acer is just feeling themselves right now. I I am all for it, and I think they're just they're just they're just in it right now. Two seven, but I mean there's still potential here. Like the gap is still very much real. Absolutely, we have to. We, we just have to see how they do in defense. You know, even the biggest team. That's true. That's do true. Read the strip. So you know it happens. And get oh, galaxy here. Trying to get the kill with um, the Overrager, unfortunately being, you know, a bit, uh, a bit slowed here by oh. all the smokes. Oh, what the heck? But, Shinkle, but counting on the setup, not to be taking damage on the enemy, but actually, actually, to put them into his cross. Sir, and two, the, two is closer they go, only one for the ace, only one for the ace, it's not going to happen, it's only going to be a 4k, but Vendra, yeah. Vendra here yeah. with the triple kill, what with the four kill, only one remaining, only what? one remaining, but Verona here with the chambers operator, handing, handing this 4k, handing this potential ace, that's two almost aces in one round. What was that round, Lutra? What the heck? First of all, okay, chicken butt. They immediately knew where the chicken butt was. Okay, well, this guy plays backside all of the time. We're just gonna go there, we're gonna get in it, we're gonna destroy their util, we're gonna make them useless. Killjoy, bam, bada bing, bada boom, gone. We're gonna push this guy. No, he's looking onto lane. Bang, bang, bang. Three shots in, another one, 4k. Vendor alone in mid, trying to push on the side to get another 4k. But Perona gets a kill and it's gonna be a win for them, pushing them into 7 3. And now it's the next round with four ults. Versus two, they are going to be scared. Bender is just going to be playing with the team right now, and they just, they just do not care. He's going to be going here. Care, and they actually so do not care that they oh. actually kill Galaxy and Acer here. Acer on the flank, surprising for surprise, oh. surprising Corona. Looks like they're just going to try to make a push to get some... onto three. Exactly, pushing on three, blocking six nice vision and. The one to the bed here, trying to get the high ground before the defense does, trying to end the rotate, taking a very aggressive position, but then, then the spike is not here yet, yeah, and the, the spike, spike is mid. So they, yeah. just have, they just have to play here, to play this high ground, okay. to play here. The one that's better with one kill, with two kills, with actually okay, not nice a third, with the third kill. Unfortunately, Vandre falling, but then. That's, that's not important, that's switch. not important because we have a round, we have the economy, we have, honestly, we have teammates to spare, we have teammates to, to it's it's okay to lose one teammate and to avenge them, because we're not at a disadvantage. It's okay if the teammates lose the weapon, because we have economy anyway. Look at Kimber, Kimber, Kimber has 6k, Kimber has so much money that they are actually buying Acer and Operator. And I love the fact that they just had, they had three people A and they're like, okay, we took this site, it's ours now. And their chamber just like, okay guys, wait for me, I'm, I'm in B, I need, I need to get the spike down. And I, it's, it's silly and I, 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 I love it. And then Trick and Butt, now it's taking a different spot here. Logs? Did they actually commonly check logs? I'm not even sure. 
do not think they have. I think what's happened here is just Look that at this um, Ace has been picked oh, here by 6969 who repositioned. And so, so uh, Construction Ahead actually decides to take control of mid, to take a few picks maybe here with uh, the one under the bed trying to Ooh. get something done while the rest of the team, the rest of the team is actually going to go to A, but then then Perona is waiting. Perona is waiting. Galaxy is positioning themselves to wait as well. <laughs> Perona almost being picked here. <laughs> taking a noscope here. A noscope here on Drago. He doesn't. He doesn't care. Oh, Dark A is getting a kill onto under the bed on tree. And now it's just Kimber alone. Well, okay, Perona gets a shorty kill and a noscope. What? Okay. <laughs> what a way to end the half there, but I mean, exactly. interesting enough. Jesus, my dudes. Jesus, what maybe that? maybe save that for the finale, not the first map. What the heck is happening? I am so confused. Well, okay, okay, construction ahead. Uh, winning along with 8 4 with a four point lead. I don't. I'm not sure here. Because honestly. Oh. Fully your mom has been like has been has made some insane plays. Especially chicken butt getting that exactly. 4k and then vendor getting that 4k as well. And then Absolutely. But the thing is, you know, we were talking about the fact that if they have a long sh you know, they are a long shot head and construction ahead, well, would be instead ahead as the name is indicating. But the yeah. thing is it's only four points here. It's four points, so it's not that important, but then Oh, oh the blind here on Ominence that's just a big melee here. Chicken but trying to uh make sure that their butts are covered indeed. And I think they make good play here because Kimber is going to come and the wand of the bed, the wand of the bed taking information here, trying to Ooh. um maybe take a peek, but the turret here, the killjoy turret making sure it doesn't happen, but then Chicken butt and uh, Dark Haze trying to go in. Kimber on the flank here is been spotted. And not only has um, per, uh, sorry Kimber here been spotted, but they have to wait for the teammates to come. And they don't actually, they pick, they pick and they take it, uh, a shot okay. on Dark Haze. Dark Haze, um, who's being basically revenge of a chicken, but waiting here for the enemy and meet it. What? I, believe is taking some kind of weapon but it oh. took so much time that chicken oh. butt is not expecting them anymore and so they are not expecting and they are surprising chicken but the one under the bed here actually making noise in garage making uh chicken butt dub what they are hearing and taking the kill with that surprise that was a very interesting push on honestly they got everyone blind on b main and uh, they got two blind kills as well but vendor gets two kills but, and, and, and both of them get evened out to two, and it was just up to um, Chicken Butt and Kimber and everyone else. And I, honestly, I thought Chicken Butt was going to win there. I'm not going to lie. I've seen what Chicken Butt can do from backside, and I thought I was going to win. But unfortunately, the monster under the bed came out and gobbled them up. You know, now we move on to the next round, 4-9. Standing ahead. With a, four, with a five point, yeah, five point lead. Absolutely, but the thing is the lead here once again not being that important because we are not making sure the economy is well spent on this second run and Dark Ace here, Dark Ace taking the, the kill on Acer and Corona here trying trying to get Vander but Vander actually taking Corona the one of the best expecting someone to come but unfortunately missing the shot and 69 getting the kill on them but Drago here, Drago in taking down Galaxy it's basically a melee everywhere mid is absolutely Oh, did, wait, did oh. the Killjoy turret actually get Vander on mid? I'm not sure. <laughs> Kimber's gonna be playing top heaven yeah, here. Are you gonna standing. expect- Oh, it doesn't matter! Gets a kill into Kimber with that shot, and now it's a 3v1 Drago with the positional advantage over Dark Ace. Now they know they're planting. Are they gonna peek this out? No, they're gonna run out out and then immediately get, try to get the kill into Arena. However, <sighs> Turns around like 69, looks on the Drago on Heaven, gets the kill. Absolutely, a bit too, a bit sad here because that was uh, very well thought to pin, punish that Reyna here. The Reyna was not, uh, not no weapon, how just you know running towards 
the main entrance of A. Unfortunately, did not connect. Did not connect in time to get the kill. Unfortunately, yeah. I honestly, I mean, that could have been possible. But unfortunately, Spectres, long range, they, do, they just do not make it work. This is not exactly. Easy. Now it looks like I, I think they're just gonna do. Oh, it's, they're gonna do that that scan combo again. Oh, it looks like they have a they have an omen sofa combo on the paper thin walls of Ascent. They're gonna get two here with some damage onto their neon. That I love that play. That was so. That was a really good play. They had their sofa scan. The omen blinded. Unfortunately, that was a really good shot from Galaxy T Stone onto Bender. But now all of them are pushed up into T spawn. Gets the kill. That was a really good read. They knew people were going B and we're gonna be like, okay, we're gonna do this combo. We're gonna, I'm gonna scan this. You're gonna blind them so they can't shoot the scan. Bam. And then their omen, their omen blind helped out the Sova. Just into well, Bing Ming. That's the thing though. The, all, the, the omen blind did not help the Sova that much because I think it connected only on chicken, but I think it was a aimed a little too high and didn't really, you know, connect with the other players. But then that's okay, because they were so diverted with that uh, blind that connected or not, you know, that they did not expect anything coming from the other side of the wall. And so Vendor actually was free to get the kills. And not only was free to get the kills, but did not really receive any damage in return, because they rather run and try to shoot beyond the wall the one that's shooting them from beyond the wall. Yeah, and we're immediately gonna get a timeout after that one, and I, I, re I honestly would as well. <laughs> like, I wouldn't shoot. Like, holy, like <laughs> paper thin walls. I just got Odin. Bang. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a timeout for a bit. I'm gonna take a little breather, and now we're gonna move on. Five ten. Bully your mom is not doing very swell here. And construction ahead with a five. Okay. So the five on that can be decisive. <laughs> Not is not this is if it can mut and then we see here the positioning they are taking good control of mid they are leaving Sova with the B and they are actually what? trying to go with the mid or the okay. A uh, defense which actually turns out right the one under the bed here with oh uh, almost oh. still Reina oh. takes Verona 699 will be able to Heal the damage that the one under the bed did to them. Oh, low special in the process. Okay, Acer gets another kill. Neon here. Gonna go get the call the six. And I tried to jump onto the generator, destroyed. doesn't get it. Looks like Chicken Bush is gonna try and peek on this side here. Now it's a three v two, and they're gonna be pushing on into A with three of them. And then it looks like they're just gonna be very wary of trees, no looking out on on from mid to catwalk. Are they going to be expecting that push from catwalk? Oh no, they're gonna immediately they take are... T spawn. Absolutely, they are going to take spawn. I think they are expecting someone to be watching mid. And Galaxy here actually trying to prevent the rotate, but unfortunately getting caught by two players, which leaves Chicken but alone. Alone against one player who is low and two are full HP. Will they be able to connect? At least they are trying to. They are going for it. Here on market, Timber. Surprising, surprising chicken butt and connecting with the head. There's a 11 point, uh, 11 round construction ahead. Yeah, they got the timing down flat. They got the timing down flat. Unfortunately for uh, for chicken butt, they didn't get it, but it was a good try. It was a good try. Now they're going to be on a six point lead here. I, I, just, I, I honestly, I still have hope. I still have hope. Well, you know. My no, someone might turn themselves on or just be like, oh, da 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 da, right? Exactly. Well, you know, with teams that play like that, like we've seen what uh, Perona can do, we've seen what 6 9 can do, we've seen what Chicken Butt can do, we can expect anything. But the thing is, Perona, one of the uh, top star players here, gets taken down. And 6 9 as well here, after tr after a, a very amazing like Acer here on the flank, takes Chicken Butt, takes Dark Ace, there is only Galaxy left. Only got to select and uh, Acer here going to connect and that is a match point, a match point match for construction point. site as they are leading by far, leading by seven points and almost, almost winning. But the thing is, on the chat, as you can see, they are already saying GG, they are already saying GG. Will they actually do the GG curse, the one GG that 
up I don't know. because you mm. to take the river sweep because we've we know how it goes you say gg before the round even starts and that's the round that you lose i think yeah i think you gotta stay positive you know even if things are looking tough you gotta stay positive it looks like they're just going to be playing here because they know they play aggro playing for picks with their galaxy <laughs> just opponents and these bond Okay, their omen has enough info. It looks like they only spot Astra out, and uh, they're not going to be pushing that one. They're just going to be playing safe, playing those passive spots where you have people peeking out. They're going to be have they're going to have Kimber on top side looking towards spawn, uh, but looks like no one's pushing spawn. What are they? What are they up to? Are they just going to, to fight it? Or are they going to actually yeah. try? I think they are going to try, I think they are going for it. They are playing cheesy, they are trying to surprise with a play that usually isn't done. Astral here trying to prove them uh, as to what they are going to do. And you see here that uh, the two duelists here, the Reyna and the Neon, Dark Ace and Six Nine, pushing, making this, but being spotted. But it's okay, run. because they are rotating. You and Perona here killing Drago in the process, Chicken, but trying to attract actually the enemy players on B, trying to um, make sure that they don't come. Kimber here left. trying to get the kill, unable to. And they are actually going to push Goodbye with that Odin, but Acer! Acer with a double edge shot! Bender gets another kill on the galaxy, but gets traded out by Funny Number. Jed getting another kill on the 69, now it's just. That was just Dark Ace and the rest, but they have the. They, they could have the plant down. Do they, know where, do they know where both of them are? I believe, it, I believe it. I believe it. Not. I believe that this is going to not to discover it no. and trying to pull out the Odin instead of going with the ult, which ultimately lead them to this round being taken by construction ahead. But honestly, Defender they almost did it. They almost took that one round. It was this almost the GG curse. But unfortunately, the second map is going to go to construction ahead. Unfortunately, it goes to. Construction ahead looks like they don't even need to warn them anymore. They've erected the statue. The monument is up there. It says we've won. And this is a GG 513 with Acer. 387 average combat score. And Vendor, obviously, with their lurking points going into 328. I am I cannot wait to see the analyst desk, which is I heard is you and um uh, Henry, correct? I believe that is indeed what's going to happen. The same news that, that we've seen uh, right before the match started. I think there's going to be a, a lot to say here, honestly, especially about the winner construction ahead, because obviously that's what interests us. It's what they're going to do in the following up of the following matches as we progress into um, the IVQCS. But then even bully your mom, we're going to have a lot of say, uh, to say about uh, this whole match, honestly. I totally agree with you there. It was honestly um that that match was a roller coaster, especially with Acer. Acer yesterday was arguably having a slower game, but the, with oh, with an average of one point seven seven one point seven to KDA. But honestly, this map especially, he popped off. I I think it's he. Yeah, um, they popped off, and I think it was insane. I'm so impressed. Absolutely, it did a lot of work, and the the thing is, they like I've mentioned that before during the cast. You know, they they, they betted a lot on the attack. They knew they were attacking first, so they took a very a grow team here and tried to uh, to take as much points as they could. And honestly, I think that's a bet that worked very very well for them. I also want to talk about the Reina pick. The Reina pick is is really dependent on how well you as a player is capable what you're you as a player is capable of doing right and i would and i'm and i think it's really interesting to see and and acer really found value in this agent pick when usually in it when it is really depending on him on them to really how do i say it like really make value out of that agent and i was really i felt really I felt really good seeing that, you know, like Ray we we often flame Reina's for in higher elo for not having the utility and saying it's a throw pick nowadays. But I think Acer really showed what kind of value um that a uh, uh Reina can have as an agent. 
Absolutely. And the thing is, I think ASO proved not necessarily the value of Reyna as a whole, but the value of Reyna as, you know, a low ELO player. Because a lot of people are going to say, no, you can't uh, you, you can't pick Reyna on low ELO because you don't know how to play, you don't know how to position, you don't know how to aim correctly. But I think low ELO is actually where Reyna is going to be thriving because she has such a sustain that if you get one kill, you can just try and go for, you know, for more than that. I agree. I, but I also want to talk about um your mom ahead for a second. Like yes, they did lose, but I think their effort was honestly amazing. What like, they, it wasn't that they were complete pushovers in this map, and they they did really well. Absolutely. And honestly, but there was huge plays on both bars. We've seen uh like an uh, one round with a double quadra almost aces on both cases and that also that that one kimber i, I believe it was kimber no it, uh, was it Piranha or kimber i remember it being chamber but it, that that one headshot that was uh oh i'm sorry i'm getting confused that one op shot sorry that was uh I, i'm really sorry i'm going to drink a bit because my <laughs> right. is trying to work against me <laughs> I think also I also want to point out Vondre here for a second. Vondre was playing the jet and popped off immensely in map one, and then they switched to Sova, and and he still managed to almost top his jet performance, and I think that's impressive. That really shows that um, he them as a player has a has has an insane map uh, has an insane 